there seems to be a major problem affecting all Fire Sticks and Fire TVs. If you just head over to the settings and click on applications. Now here you'll notice straight away that when I change this to recency, which then shows you which applications you've used recently and of course which applications you haven't touched for a while. Now if I scroll down, we can see for example it's saying I've never used Downloader and I've used that today. For example, it's saying I've never used the TDUK app killer, which I also use today. And the reason why this is a big issue is if you have the new feature, the app offloading enabled on your device, app offloading will automatically remove any applications it thinks you haven't used for a while. And if I follow the logic here, it will automatically remove the app killer, it will automatically remove downloader and really any application it thinks I haven't used for a while. Now to properly demonstrate this bug, let's now open up the TDUK app killer. Let's click on launch. We can see that opens okay. I can now press back, back again. Let's now also open up a downloader, which I use all the time. Let's open that up, click on launch. So I've now launched those two applications. If I now press home again, let's go back and look at the applications. And here you'll see, for example, if I again change the sorting to recency, let's click on that. Let's scroll to the bottom because the applications that you do use on a daily basis will appear at the bottom. And we can see now it's correctly saying downloader was used today and the TDUK app killer was used today. But here's the real issue guys. If I now just press the play button and the select button, if I hold them down for 10 seconds, and this is the quickest way to initiate a device reboot. We can see we get the message that my device is now restarting. And I've confirmed this is the issue on both the Amazon Fire OS 7 devices and also the Fire OS 8 devices. But do leave me a comment below if you see this issue on yours. And the way you check that you have an issue is if I now go back in, let's go over to the settings again. Let's scroll down into applications. Go to the manage and install applications. And once again, let's now sort this list by recency. And would you believe it guys, after a quick reboot, it's now saying once again, I've never ever used downloader. Scrolling down and it's once again saying that I've never ever used the TDUK app killer. So this actually has massive consequences because the majority of people will have app offloading enabled on their device. And in this state, this is not correctly detecting when applications are being opened. And as soon as you restart the device, it seems to just reset that counter. And many people do regularly restart their devices. So in that case, this list will never have the correct information on which applications you are regularly using. We can see automatic offload has been enabled by default. That means as soon as the device detects that your device is running a bit low on storage, it will randomly remove any of these applications, even though you literally used them a couple of hours ago or used them the day before, because they can't properly track when these applications are being used. There really is a big risk that your regularly used applications may incorrectly become uninstalled. So because of this guys, now I do actually recommend that, that you go back into MyFi TV, click on about, click on storage. I do recommend that you turn this off. Before I was saying generally for most people, you can leave this on because firstly, it doesn't target your third party applications, your side loaded applications. It's really only for the standard Amazon application. So what's the harm if it uninstalls something that you haven't used for a while, like downloader. But as we've seen today, guys, there is a risk that those applications may incorrectly become uninstalled. So definitely worthwhile turning off. Do leave me a comment below and let me know if you also have this recency bug where it doesn't properly detect the applications that you have been using. Do leave me a comment below. Let me know. I know we are fast approaching the end of the year. So I just want to wish everybody happy holidays wherever you are in the world. I do actually have a couple of other videos lined up in the next few days. So do look out for those and I'll hopefully catch up with you guys real soon. Thanks.